You're, you're, you're mute. I'm back. <laughs> okay, now yes. Now you can hear me. Okay, we were listening Gabby M, right? Yes. Okay, Gabby, we're going to listen to you once again. Um, again. I'd like to give my family healthy food. Okay. So do I. I do too. Mm -hmm. And the last one, I don't like to give my family junk food. Mm -hmm. I don't like either, neither do I. Very good, excellent job. And last, no least, let me double check who else was in yesterday's class. Uh -huh. No, everybody participated, Alejandro. Okay, Alejandro, we'll listen to you. Okay, I like eat sushi. I so do I. I. So do I. <laughs> I can't write well in English. N neither can I. Mm -hmm. I'm not like dance. I'm done either. Mm -hmm. Very good. Excellent job. Excellent job. You know why, honey, you know what happened with my computer? Why uh, it didn't disappear and now I had to initiate again? It's because Mr. Alexander came into the platform. Alexander, that's because of you. Aha, uh -huh. and he disappears. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so every time that Alexander wants to jump in, I don't know what happens, but something happens with the internet. I'm just kidding. Okay, very good job, guys. So we're going to continue, okay? And guys, we're going to practice right now pronunciation pronunciation okay. and intonation for so do I, so can I, or I do too, or neither do I, or I don't either, okay? okay. Because I want you guys to not only know how to pronounce those words, but at the same time, where you need to put the correct intonation on those short phrases, okay? We're going to practice okay. right now. Just a moment. So I am... Um, you can listen to what I'm have it. Okay, no, I'm going to close this right now. And let me open it. And then I will share my screen with you. There you go. Tell me guys as soon as you are able to see my screen, okay? There you go. Can you see it guys? Yes? yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Okay, guys. So in this in this part of this um activity, we're going to um develop the pronunciation and we're going to also to learn how stress in responses. You know what a stress is, guys? Something because of stress? Yeah. No? No. A stress no. is donde usted tiene que poner la mayor fuerza de voz a la hora de pronunciar algo. That's a stress. Mm. If you still have fijan, we got four groups of words. See, we have four groups. We have I do too, I am too, I can too. We have so do I, so am I, so can I. And we have the examples with either in either. If you still have fijan, they are different. So we're going to learn how to pronounce it. Okay? Please, guys, I just want you on the first part, I just want you just to listen. Okay? And on the second time, we're going to listen each group and we're going to pronounce it after the, the recorder, okay? Do you understand me? I understand. Okay, cool. Let's listen. Size four, pronunciation. Stress in responses. Part A, listen and practice. Notice how the last word of each response is stressed. I do too. I am too. I can too. So do I. So am I. So can I. I don't either. I'm not either. I can't either. Neither do I. Neither am I. Neither can I. Okay, guys, let me put it once again so we can practice. Okay, cool. Page 88, 
Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Stress in Responses. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how the last word of each response is stressed. I do too. Repeat, please, guys. I do too. Repeat them, por favor. I do too. I do too. I do too. Okay. Vamos al siguiente. I am too. Repeat, guys. I am too. I am too. Very good. I can too. Again, please, guys. I can too. I can too. Very good. Cada vez que yo pause, necesito que you repeat what they said, okay? Vamos al siguiente grupo. So do I. So do I. So do I. So, do I. so am I. So am I. So am I. I. So can I. So can I. So can I. I don't either. 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 I'm not either. I'm not either. I can't either. I can't either. Very good. Okay, and then the last group. Neither do I. Neither do I. Neither do I. Neither am I. Neither am I. Neither am I. Neither can I. Neither can I. Very good. Hoy vamos a hacer otro ejercicio. I'm going to place it once again, guys. Pero voy a dejar que diga todos los del primer grupo y lo vamos a repetir todos de un solo. Después todos los del segundo grupo y los repetimos todos de un solo. Y así vamos. ¿Les parece? Ok. okay. Very cool. Practice. Page 88, Exercise 4, Pronunciation. Stress in Responses. Part A. Listen and Practice. Notice how the last word of each response is stressed. I do too. I am too. I, I can I too. Do. Okay, now repeat all of the first group, guys. I do too. I do, I do too. too. I am, I am too. too. I am too. I can too. too. Very good. Quiero que todos de un solo, ¿ok? No, me, no se me tracen. Ok, vamos a ver el segundo grupo. Two. So do I. So am I. So, so can I. Ok, vamos al segundo grupo, guys. Go ahead. So, so, so do I. I. So I. So I. Can I. Ah, ah. No, yo creo que se me, no, me, no me escucho bien el segundo grupo. ¿Pueden repetirlo otra vez? So do I. So do I. So am I. So can I. Very good. So do I. So am I. So can I. ¿Se fijan que el estrés va en el do I, am I y el can I? Yes. 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 That's why the little, the little circle is there. Ok. Very good. Y si ustedes se fijan en el primer grupo, el estrés... The response and it's in el two. Yes. Vamos a ver ahorita en el en el tercer grupo el stress va a ser en las primeras dos letras de either. Ya van a ver. I don't either. I'm not either. I can't either. Okay, repeat please, guys. I don't either. I don't either. I'm not either. Either. Again, please, porque necesito el stress el stress voice. Go ahead, go ahead once again. I don't either. either. I'm not either. Either. I can't either. Very good. Vamos al last group. Neither do I. Neither am I. Neither can I. Very good. Neither am I. Neither can I. Neither do I. Neither am I. Neither can I. Very good. Excellent. So the stress voice is in the last. It's in, in I. Si se fijan es en el I. O sea que los tres grupos es diferente. It's really different. Okay, yeah. who can say it for me? Thank you so much for participating, Fernando. Puedes decirme lo del primer grupo, por favor. Fernando. Hello, teacher. I'm sorry. Hello. That's okay. Can you please pronounce it for me, the first group? El que okay. dicen tú. Mm -hmm. I do too. Mm -hmm. I am too. 
I can too. Very good, excellent. Can you please pronounce it for me? The second group, Moran? Yeah. So do I. So am I, and so can I. Can you please repeat it to me, the, the, the second one once again, with am? So am I. So? So, so am I. So am I. So am I. Okay, dale otra vez, lo, todo otra vez. So do I, so am I, so can I. Very good, excellent. The third group, Christian, could you please repeat it for me? Mr. Christian, are you there with me? I think it's working. Mm, Alexander, go ahead. I don't either. I'm not either. I can either. Fantastic. Very good job. Excellent. Last but not least, um, Gabby M, go ahead. Neither do I, neither am I, neither can I. Very good. Excellent job. Okay, guys. So let's continue. Ya estamos bien, verdad? We yes. know how to do it. Okay, let me continue right now, guys, and we're going to introduce a new topic, which in this case will be the model verbs with would and will. Pero antes de ver eso, ¿ya lo han usado los model verbs? ¿Ya han usado would and will? Yes. Okay. ¿Para qué lo han usado? Future. Uh, mm -hmm. Will for future and would. For future. Um, Mm -hmm. Exacto, algo que te gustaría. Ok, guys, can you see my screen right now? ¿Sí? ¿Pueden verla? Yes. Ok, cool. Yes. Si ustedes se fijan en este screen, we have a new model verse for you, right? We do have, well, May, ya lo habíamos visto, ¿no es cierto? Yes. Ok, but now, guys, we have this verb, this one, would. Lo tenemos en respuesta, lo tenemos en pregunta. También tenemos will, ¿verdad? También tenemos aquí would, otra vez. ¿Dónde más tenemos would, guys? And the answer. Um, and uh, this the, one. The question, yeah. the question. The question and, and the answer as well. Very good job. Okay, guys. So, we're going to practice. We're going to listen, guys, this dialogue right now to introduce would and will. And then we're going to practice the dialogue, okay? This... Um, class will be basically listening and speaking okay okay, okay guys are you ready ready yes are you sure sure yes 100 yes, sure okay cool all right very good so let me continue with that but i'm going to do something really quickly okay so allow me a couple of minutes let me share right now my screen and then we continue here you go. Exercise six, conversation, ordering a meal. Part A, listen and practice. May I take your order? Yes, I'd like the spicy fish and rice. All right, and would you like a salad? Yes, I'll have a mixed green salad. Okay, what kind of dressing would you like? We have blue cheese and vinaigrette. Blue cheese, please. And would you like anything to drink? Yes, I'd like a large iced tea, please. Okay, would you like to play it one more time, guys? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Six, conversation, ordering a meal. Part A, listen and practice. May I take your order? Yes. I'd like the spicy fish and rice. All right. And would you like a salad? Yes. I'll have a mixed green salad. Okay. What kind of dressing would you like? We have blue cheese and vinaigrette. Blue cheese, please. And would you like anything to drink? Yes. I'd like a large iced tea, please. Very good. Excellent. Okay, guys, tell me, according to what you have heard, uh, this dialogue, where is taking? Is the, are they in a in a house? Are they in a hotel? Are they in a restaurant? What do you think, guys? In a restaurant. In a restaurant. A restaurant. restaurant. Maybe a cafeteria, right? A cafe. Mm -hmm. That could yeah. be. Okay. Tell me, guys. Um, what is exactly the what is he asking for? What what is the client wants to eat? 
fish and rice with fish a and salad rice. and mm -hmm. iced tea. And I see. Okay. What about the dressing? The cheese. Okay, exactly. The server offered him two choices, right? Vinaigrette, Vinaigrette and blue cheese. Vinaigrette. But which one he decided? Blue cheese. Blue the blue cheese. cheese, exactly. Very good. And as Gabby said, for something to drink was an iced tea, right? Okay, very good. Should we practice this dialogue, guys? Yes, right? Okay, good. Big team, sorry, volunteers. Um, uh, Alexander, would you like to be the server? Okay. Okay, and um, who else? Alex, are you with me? No, Alex is not here, right? Okay, Luis, would you like to be the customer? Okay. Okay, cool. Action, go ahead. May I take your order? Yes, I like the spices, fish and rice. All right. And would you like a salad? Yes. I have a mixed green salad. Okay. What kind of this thing would you like? We have blue cheese and vinaigrette. Blue cheese, please. And would you like and, uh, anything? 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 Any, anything to drink? Yes. I like a beer, please. Ah, no, 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 no. Don't change the dialogue, Luis. <laughs> Yes. Don't I, like the the dialogue, last please. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> All right. Very good job. Alexander, you sound like a server. You have a really good voice, like a customer service voice. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. And you have a really, a really nice customer, right? <laughs> yeah, okay. very good. Excellent job, guys. Okay. Let we have Second victim, so second participants. Uh, Mr. Moran, would you like to be the server? Yes, right. And um, who else? Fernando, would you like to be the customer? Okay. Cool. Okay, go ahead, guys. Action, please. May I take your order? Yes. In like that spade fish and rice. All right. And would you like a salad? Yes. I had a mix of green salad. Okay, what kind of dressing would you like? We have blue cheese and vinaigrette. Mm -hmm. Blue cheese, please. And would you like anything to drink? Yes, I like a uh, lot of tea, please. All right, very good. Okay, guys, before we move on and we continue as studying the wood and like good pronunciation by the way Luis very good especially with the contractions that I know uh, they are not your your uh, your friends right but that's okay good job excellent we're going to learn guys this one wood and wheel in about a minute but I just came back to you because I just want you to give you a surprise mm -hmm. actually it's going to be your homework Oh, no, teacher. Yes, students. You know what is going to be the homework? I'm going to send you this dialogue. Okay? Okay. And we're going to do it some more interactive. Okay? So basically, guys, I want you to learn this dialogue because you're going to get into characters. You're going to put them in, in, the, in the real scenario. Okay? See? Okay. 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 So I'm going to choose which one goes with which one. Quien va con quien? Y quién va a ser el server y quién va a ser el customer. So tomorrow, voy a elegir a dos, a dos o tres parejas a lo mucho. Y van a ser como que you are the server y como que tú eres el customer. Pero by memory. ¿Ok? By memory. ¿Sí? Entonces vamos a decir, por ejemplo, Sandrita con Luisito. Un ejemplo. ¿Right? Y de hecho, vayan a ser ustedes la pareja. ¿Ves? <laughs> eh, yeah. Uh, Luisito, you're going to be the customer. You have done okay. a really good job with customer. In San Diego, you're going to be the server, okay? okay. Así que, así que ustedes se me, se me, se me viste como server, right? Con su mantelito. How you say that in, his, uh, in Spanish? No, it's not mantelito. It's like, um, mandil, right? Mandil, no? Mandil. Delantal. Oh, delantal. Thank you. Thank, thank you, Gabby. It's mandil. It's, it's, a, it's a Nahuatl word, see? ¿sí? Porque viene del Nahuatl, right? Yes. Pero se usa mucho en Costa Rica. Mandil. 
Pero es, es, es delantal, como dice Gaby. Very good job. Okay, so you're going to be the first group, okay? Uh, Moran, you're going to be the server, porque has hecho un tremendo job como server. Very good. And Victor, you're going to be the customer, okay? Great job. Okay. And Gaby M. Yes. You're going to be uh, the server. And Alejandro, okay. you're going to be the customer, okay? And who else? Okay. Alexia, you have to be here tomorrow. If not, you're going to get in trouble. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Alexia, you're going to be um, the customer. And uh, okay. Alexander, you're going to be the server, okay? Okay. And uh, who else is missing? I'm missing Alejandro and Christian, right? Okay, Alejandro, you're going to be the, the server and Christian is going to be the customer, okay? Okay. ¿Se acuerdan con quién va, say... verdad? Yes. <laughs> okay. And I, uh, I'm with Alejandro or with yes. Alejandro? No, with Alexander. Ah, okay. Alejandro is with Christian. Okay? Okay, guys. So we're going to practice. Okay? We already have practice. We're good. I'm going to send it to you this dialogue so you can practice at home. Pero los quiero vestidos así como, como the si fueran. Same yes, the same dialogue. Yes, the same dialogue. Yes? Con su delantal y toda la cosa. Y si usted quiere, usa una cosita de papel. Like, I don't know. How am I going to say it? Oh, yes. Like this? Yes. So, what will be your menu? Okay? okay? Yes, you can use your imagination. And also, guys, <laughs> you can be at your living room, okay? So, you start in your living room, no problem. Or in your dining room. Teacher. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes, Alexander? In my case, I don't have a camera because I damaged the telephone, so I connect to the laptop and it doesn't have Really? Okay. And who will be with you? Ah, Gaby, right? Alexia. Alexia. Alexia will be with you. Uh -huh. yeah. No. Oh, sí. yeah. I think that you yes, um, yes. repeat the name. Ah, okay. okay. Because you, you said me that I, uh, I... I said, right, that you will go with Alexander, right? Alejandro. Ah, okay. So you go with Alejandro and, Ale and Alexander will go with Alexi. But Alejandro, at the end, you said that... Uh, with Christian, right? Yes. Yes. Okay, so that's good. We leave it like that way. Dejémoslo así. Va a ser más chivo. Entonces con Alejandro voy yo. Yes. Okay. So Alejandro okay. and two customers. And nice. Y Alexia with, with Alexander. Ah, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. So don't worry about that. That's going to be interesting. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay, very good. So let's continue, right? Let's continue and let's focus right now, guys, on the two modal verbs that we're going to see today. Uh, would and will. And also we're going to practice that pronunciation. Not only the pronunciation of the questions, pronunciation of sentences, and also pronunciation of contractions, okay? Because I just want you guys to pay attention on that. So let, let's continue, okay? And then we're going to discuss. Victor, what happened? Why you are so shy today? What happened? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Don't worry. I'm going to ask you, okay? So don't worry. Be patient. Okay. Yes. Okay, so let me share right now my screen and let's continue, guys. This is just about listening, okay? So let's continue right now. Okay, you like it, right? But no, I don't want this. One. There you go. That's what I want. Okay. Page 89. Uh, no. No, not yet. No. Okay. Yes. Okay, guys. So today we're going to talk about mother first would and will for requests. Okay. Ven que eso dos se ocupó en el dialogue anterior. Sí. Yes. Por ejemplo, usted dice, would you like something to drink? Mira la primera pregunta. What would you like? ¿Qué le gustaría? Sí. ¿Por qué mm -hmm. creen que está would y like en negrita? Yes. Exactly. ¿Por qué van juntos? Para que tenga sentido. Exactly. Porque si yo digo, what would, ¿me entienden? No. No, ¿verdad? 
¿Se acuerdan que los modal verbs por ellos mismos no tienen significado? Modal verb es como un verbo modular que le ayuda al verbo principal, que en este caso es like, a tener sentido. So, si yo digo, what would you like, ¿qué le estoy preguntando? En un gustaría? restaurante, ¿Qué, por ejemplo. ¿Qué le gustaría? Exacto, ¿qué le gustaría? Miren la respuesta que tiene usted a su lado derecho. I like the fish and ride. Mira, la, el mismo verbo que usted utiliza para preguntar es el mismo verbo que usted responde, ¿de acuerdo? Solo, chicos, que aquí, si usted se fija, está en forma contractada, ¿sí o no? Uh -huh. yes. Mire, entonces, me gustaría que lo repitiera después de mí. I'd. I'd, 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 I'd like the fish and rice. I'd like the fish and rice. Fish and rice. Very good, very good. Hoy utilicemos, pero, oh, yeah. exacto, utilizamos el will. Esta es la contracción de will. I'll, I'll have a small salad, please. I'll, I'll have, have a small, a small salad. salad. A small salad. Very good. Mire, usted aquí al, al lado derecho tiene las contracciones. I'll equals I will. Y I'd equals I would. ¿Sí? Yes. Esto es para que ustedes ya lo saben. Ok, very good. Let me go to the second one. Repeat after me, please, guys. What kind of dressing would you like? What kind of dressing would you like? like? ¿Qué le estoy preguntando yo allí? ¿Qué tipo de cena de estaría? De ¿Qué tipo de aderezo? De aderezo. De aderezo. Okay. Dressing es aderezo. Si usted se fija, I have two options, right? El blue cheese y el vinaigrette, ¿no es cierto? Yes. Entonces, usted puede usar lo mismo con los dos. Pero si usted, por ejemplo, gusta usar would, tiene que utilizar el verbo con que usted hizo la pregunta. En este caso es like. Se dice, I like blue cheese, please. O si usted quiere utilizar will, lo tiene que utilizar con otro verbo. Si usted se fija. Normalmente lo utiliza con have. I'll have a vinaigrette. ¿Sí? Obtendré vinagreta, por decir así. Mora, you have a question, by the way. ¿Cómo debería de interpretar esa respuesta? Yo quiero vinagreta. Sí, yo deseo. Yo quiero vinagreta. Yo quisiera. O yo también. quisiera. Yo, yo porque tendría. Porque futuro. Uh -huh. I will have. I will yo have. Tendría. Yo, yo, yo tendría o yo quisiera tener, right? Vinagreta. Ajá, yo ¿Ya? quisiera. Yo quisiera uh -huh. tener, exacto. Y, y I would like. I, 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 uh -huh. I will want. Vinagrette. Uh, 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 want es desear. Ok. Podría uh -huh. decir, I want vinagrette. Sí, podría, pero no son, porque más que todo el want lo ocupamos cuando usted quisiera no algo de comida, sino que quisiera que algo cambiara en su vida. ¿Me entiende? Es, es, mm. es parecido. Parecido, I want to change my life. Exactly. Es parecido, pero no siempre se utiliza. Se podría usar, ¿sí? O algún americano lo entendería que es lo que usted está, está diciendo. Pero grammatically is not quite correct. Porque depende Miss, para qué lo quiere. Uh -huh. Miss, um, yes. and can I say I wish have a vinegar? Uh, sí. Wish es el verbo, wish es algo de desear. Pero desear en el sentido que... Que, que, algo, que algo que tú tienes ahorita, te gustaría que no fuera así, que fuera diferente. ¿Me entiendes? Mm, ok. ¿Ya? Exactly. Porque wish, por ejemplo, eh, es algo que tú quisieras cambiar de tu realidad actual. Ya lo vamos a ver. De hecho, lo vamos a ver en esta semana, el wish. Para expresar, expresar cosas que quisieras cambiar en, el, en tu presente. ¿Me entiendes? No, okay. Por ejemplo, I wish I could travel to Paris. Me gustaría o viajar, a París. viajar a París. Pero ahorita no puedes por muchas cosas. Porque no tienes plata. O porque los aeropuertos no están abiertos. Right? O en eso por la mm -hmm. pandemia. No. Right? Who knows? Who knows? Okay. Exactly. ¿Y, si, y si dijera mm -hmm. I would like Paris. I would like París. ¿Te gustaría París? I would like, uh, I would like to travel. To, to, to travel to París. Uh -huh. También Podría. estaría diciendo yo, a mí me gustaría ir a París. Eh, no. Sí, pero no, no con el mismo <risa> sentimiento, ¿me entiendes? 
No, por, eso, por eso es que no quiero todavía, chicos, entrar a Wish, porque es bien diferente. Entiendo sus, mm. sus inquietudes, pero Wish lo voy a ver mañana con ustedes y les voy a decir cuál es la diferencia. Okay. So don't worry about that. En okay. esta sería, teacher, como que, eh, que le diga, ¿querés agua o soda? Uh -huh. O sea, decidir entre, entre dos acciones o cambiar una de las dos acciones. Exactamente, Alexander. You're totally right. Okay. Exacto. Te gustaría o me gustaría tal cosa. En, chicos, una de las cosas que utilizamos would, y eso es una de las diferencias con wish, es que usted dice, I would like blue cheese, por ejemplo, en el caso que vimos del restaurante, cuando a ustedes se les presentan dos opciones, Dos o tres opciones. Y usted tiene que elegir por alguna de ellas en el momento en que usted está hablando. ¿Sí? Por ejemplo, si yo le digo, what kind of dressing would you like? Le digo yo a Morán. Blue cheese o vinaigrette. Entonces, Morán me dice, I would like blue cheese, please. Me gustaría blue cheese. ¿Me entiende? Okay. Yes, Porque le estoy dando opciones en el momento. Esa es una de las diferencias con wish. Eh, vamos al otro. Eh, ¿Quién? Eh, a ver. Uh, Gaby M, could you please be so kind to read it for me the third question? What would you like to drink? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué le gustaría tomar? We have two options. Can you please read for me the answers, Gaby? I'd like a nice tea. I'd, I'll have coffee. Very good. Cualquiera de las dos opciones, right? And the last one, Moran, could you please be so kind to read it for me? Would you like anything else? Mm -hmm. Can I have the answers, please? Yes, please. I'd like some water. No, uh -huh. thank you. That, that's yeah. BL. Mm -hmm. No te preocupes, ya vamos a ver la pronunciación. Very good. Si ustedes se fijan, las tres primeras, right? They are, what kind of question, guys? ¿Qué tipo de questions son? WH questions. WH questions, exactly. Y si ustedes se fijan, WH questions, we need... A uh, more answer, right? A big answer, right? But on this one, si usted utiliza el would al principio, que en este caso es la, la, el último ejemplo que tenemos acá, se convierte en una just no questions. Y mira la respuesta, mira. Just please. No, thank you. Y usted tiene la opción de añadir más información si usted desea. ¿Sí? Okay, yes. Okay. Let's practice the pronunciation. Are we good right now? So far, so good? Por lo menos con el uso del would and will? I got a question. Yes, go ahead. I'm listening to you. Will, I can use. La se le explicaré en español mejor. Yes, lo I'm puedo listening usar to con, you. Lo puedo usar con how. Sí, podría. Como, how would you like to drink? Or, Something like that. Okay, for example, si sí, podría usarlo, por ejemplo, how would you like this party to, no, how would you like this party to, to do, or how would you like these things to move? Si, ¿Sí? como te gustaría que estas cosas se movieran? Mm -hmm. Or where would you like to go? Donde te gustaría ir? ¿Sí? No, okay. Where would you like to go? Or which country would you like to visit? Ok. Ya. Eh, yo les mandé un link de los Modoverse. ¿De casualidad lo estudiaron? I have a problem in internet. Ay, sí, Moran. I don't believe you. Because you're an IT. Ok. No. Entonces lo tienen que repasar. Pero de todos modos, le voy a... Y, y ahí está la diferencia, fíjense, entre would y wish. Ajá. Let's practice, guys, the pronunciation, ok? Let's practice it. Okay. Let me practice a pronunciation right now with those. Very good. Nine, exercise seven, grammar focus. Modal verbs would and will for requests. What would you like? I'd like the fish and rice. I'll have a small salad. What kind of dressing would you like? I'd like blue cheese, please. I'll have vinaigrette. 
What would you like to drink? I'd like an iced tea. I'll have coffee. Would you like anything else? Yes, please. I'd like some water. No, thank you. That'll be all. Contractions. I'll equals I will. I'd equals I would. Would you like to play it one more time, guys? Yes. Okay. Size 7. Grammar focus. Modal verbs would and will for requests. What would you like? I'd like the fish and rice. I'll have a small salad. What kind of dressing would you like? I'd like blue cheese, please. I'll have vinaigrette. What would you like to drink? I'd like an iced tea. I'll have coffee. Would you like anything else? Yes, please. I'd like some water. No, thank you. That'll be all. Contractions. I'll equals I will. I'd equals I would. Very good. Now, guys, I will put it one more time, but I just want you that after the, the recorder finish asking the questions, you need to repeat, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. ¿Sí? Vamos a practicar la, la pronunciation, guys. Entonces, hace la pregunta en, y ustedes lo practican, ¿ok? Ok. 7. Grammar focus. Modal verbs would and will for requests. What would you like? Repeat, please, guys. What would you like? No, What solo, would you solo like? Luisito lo escucho. Once again, please, guys. What, What would you like? Would you like? Again. What would you like? What would you like? Very good. Okay, listen to the answer, okay? And then you're going to say it again. I'd like the fish and rice. Repeat, please, guys. I like the fish and rice. I like the fish and rice. Okay. Then the second answer. I'll have a small salad. Okay, I want to hear you guys. I'll have, 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 have a small salad. salad. Um, very good. Second question. What kind of dressing would you like? Okay. What kind, what of, kind dressing of dressing would you like? Would you like? Would you Very like? good. Okay, now repeat the answers. I'd like blue cheese, please. I'll have vinaigrette. I'd like, I'd, I'd like blue cheese. I'd like, I'd like, I'd like blue cheese. cheese. I'll have vinaigrette. I'll have vinaigrette. Very good. Third question. What would you like to drink? I'd like an iced tea. What I'll have coffee. I'd like to drink. I'd like iced tea. I'll have coffee. I'll have coffee. Very good. And the last one. Would you like anything else? Yes, please. Would you like anything else? Would you like anything else? Would you like anything else? Yes, please. Yes, please. Okay. I'd like some water. I'd like some water. Thank you. No, thank you. That'll be all. That'll be all. Okay, we're going to practice this one, right? Because I know that this one is a little bit hard for you. This one. Let me put it here. This one, right? This one. Repeat after me. Dial. 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 B. 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 O. B. O. O. Dial B. 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 Okay, Moran, could you please repeat it? That'll be all. Very good. You see, not too bad. Excellent. Please. Yes, Victor. Eso, eso sería todo. Así sería. Uh -huh. That'll be all. That'll be all. Exacto. Es como, es como lo, eh, donde uh, Bugs Bunny, que dice, that's all, folks. Eso es todo, amigos. Right? That's all, folks. Es una manera de decir, that'll be all as well. Like this class. Exactly. That's all. Aha, uh -huh, like this class, exactly, Luis. You know what? You're right. We finish. Yay. Uh, you see, Luis is really happy. Uh -huh, I know that he doesn't love me, but that's okay. Okay, guys. So we practice that. I know that today was a little bit like me mm, because we learn about grammar, right? But I know tomorrow will be much fun.
But did you practice the listening skill? We practice the listening skill? And we practice that? Pronunciation. Okay. So, guys. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Inventado. No way. No. Es el dialogue que te voy a mandar, que vimos ahorita. Ese. Para que usted eh, como que se acostumbre a usar el would y el will. Mañana vamos a ver el wish. Y para aquellos chicos que quieren saber what's the difference between would and wish, porque creo que Morán dice, pues es lo mismo, hombre, ¿cuál es la diferencia? Come on. No, no. no. Way. They are not. <laughs> They are not. ¿En qué chat? Porque yo no recibo nada. WhatsApp. ¿Usted no tiene el WhatsApp? Claro que sí, pero nunca he recibido ningún chat. Are you sure? Let serio? me check. Let me check. I have my WhatsApp. This is Alcatel One Touch, by the way. Okay, let me check. All right. Yeah, I don't know. Let me check. You should be here. Yes, you should be here. Let me check. I will open it right now. So let me just one moment. Okay. What's your phone number, Sandri? Mm -hmm. okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Let me check if you're here. No, you're not in the no group. Está. Oh, tell me something. When they send you the message, cuando te mandaron el mensaje del enrollment, del curse, te tuvieron que mandar el URL de los, de los YouTube videos, te tuvieron que mandar cuál es el código de tu grupo y te tuvieron que mandar el WhatsApp group. Yes. ¿Sí? En ese correo, when you click on the WhatsApp group, te dice, would you like to join the WhatsApp group? Entonces, ahí tienes que darle. Oh, yes, so you yes. can enroll, ¿ok? Yeah. Ok. Ajá. Okay. Uh -huh. Así que nada. Aquí está. Aquí está. Ah, ah, sí, sí. Entonces me safé del, del examen. No way. ¿Sí? <laughs> no way. Ok. Alrighty, yeah. guys. Sí, sí. Entonces ya, ya vas a aparecer acá. Ok. Y luego voy a send it to you. Ok, guys. I know, maybe today was a really bit boring, right? It's fue un poco aburrida la clase. I'm sorry for that. No, no, it's, it's, no, it's sorry, good. Sorry, sorry, it's good. It's good. Fun. Okay, I think I have you here. Let me check. Okay. Saludos cordiales. Yay! You're here. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, very good. Okay, guys, so I want everybody to be here because I'm going to send it to you, okay? Today... No, tomorrow morning, because today is a late, okay? You have to go to sleep, okay? okay. Right, Moran? You're almost late. Oh. Yes. I will work. <laughs> ah, you will work. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. You can, you, uh, okay, guys, uh, you can uh, buy something to Moran. Maybe he can have a cup of coffee, black coffee. I don't coffee. I don't what like coffee. What about Coke? <laughs> I don't like Coca-Cola. What about when I tea? Uh, no. What I about like chocolate? Water. Water. Beers. Water. Water. No, <laughs> no, no, no. That is not a good <laughs> advice, Luis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so what he can do in order for him to be awake, guys? ¿Qué puede hacer él para estar despierto? Breath. No, he, he said he doesn't like coffee. Breath all, all day. <laughs> But he needs to wake up right now because he's going to work uh, the whole night, right? Or no? Saying uh, deeply, deeply for death. What would be a good recommendation, Fernando? Because that had happened to you. Saying his favorite song. Oh, you see, Victor? Uh, Victor said he. you need to think in your favorite song. Repeat recommendation, please. Yes, I, I don't. I don't hear you. <laughs> maybe, maybe you need to sing your favorite song. Ah, sing your favorite song. Sure, it's correct. Say, cold water. Cold water. Yes. Cold, yes. cold water. 
this is my recommendation for him. Okay, you see, recommendation. Drink a lot, Drink of, a lot of cold, cold water. Yes. Okay. That's good. A mí me funcionó. Okay, you see? Okay. It works for her. That's what she said. <laughs> Alexia, right? Yes. Okay. Did you listen, Moran? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You much. <laughs> Yo hubiera hecho algo. ¿El qué? Si hubiera, tenido, si hubiera tenido un ex, un gato, le hubiera puesto la cola cerca de la silla y cada vez que me dormía y hubiera para atrás, le pateo la cola y el gato te tira, se, te, se te lanza y me voy a <laughs> That works. <laughs> no solo por el arañazo, sino por el... Mm -hmm. That works uh, a lot. You're a bad person. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm a smart guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys. It's time to say goodbye, okay? Hugs and kisses. Study. And see you tomorrow. Okay. Hey.